good morning and welcome to Bumblebee Junction. Hi guys and welcome back to the channel. It is a beautiful warm day and yeah, we are past our last frost day. So it is time to get in there and really get planting in the garden. Today I want to plant green beans. Now what I'm going to be planting today are jade green beans. And yeah, we love to can them and we put several crops of green beans in every year. But yes, I'm excited. It is time to go play in the dirt. So let's get to work. Okay. This bag doesn't need very much. What I have are two bags of flour and vegetable soil and some black cow. I'm going to get these spread out and raked in. So give me just a minute. I'll go ahead and put a break in here that way. I'm marking out a little music and you don't have to watch every little thing. But hold on and I'll be right back. Okay, I've got everything stirred in, mixed in, and leveled back out. And the only thing that I want to do now is add some Joe's vegetable and tomato, and then I'm just going to mix it in with the rake just a little bit. Now Mark has told me that on a couple of our videos I mentioned adding vitamins into the bed and yeah if you've watched the channel for a few years you know that I'm a hot mess I did not mean vitamins People take vitamins. Garden bags need minerals. But. I did have a nice chuckle over it. So, but now that I've got the jokes in there, I'm just going to tickle this in just a little bit. One thing about established garden beds every year you have to add a little bit less to them but you still have to keep the good nutrition in there for the plants all of the minerals that they need now all of these beds were originally done with super soil and it takes quite a while to really build the soil level up in these beds. They do go down a bit every year, but thankfully this year, most of the beds are still pretty full and they don't need a whole lot other than some really good fertilizer. But, now that I have this bed prepped, I'm going to get my seeds and then we're going to get to work. Okay, now we're going to bring the camera down in here a little closer. These are jade beans. They're a bush type bean.
Mm. It's a lovely smell of fresh dirt. Wonderful. But time to get to work. Now, beans, you can plant pretty close together, especially when they are in a nutrient-rich soil. And I'm just going to put them in uh, probably about three fingers apart. They don't have to be terribly deep. Now we like green beans fresh from the garden. And steaming them I think is my favorite. But we plant several crops of green beans over the season so that we can can them also. And I like to freeze some. You can use green beans in so many things. They are really, really easy to grow. And it's a beautiful day to be sitting out here. But I have this whole long bed to do. So I'm going to put just a little break in here and I get all of these planted. I know my rows are never perfectly straight, but <laughs> I don't think they care and um, I just want to get some of these good beans in here. Um, let me change camera angle a little bit, and I'll be right back. Okay, we got everybody planted. Just gonna tuck them in. The only other thing left is to put a little bit of water on them. And then Mark can start asking if the beans are up yet. It's kind of a running joke that we have around here. Beans don't take very long to come up. They will be up in a matter of a few days. So, no Mark, the beans are not up quite yet, but everybody's planted. It's a wonderful, easy crop to grow. And yeah, looking forward to fresh beans. So, I'm gonna go ahead and get the rest of these all tucked in and I'll be right back. Okay, it has been an absolutely beautiful morning to be out here planting beans and the wind's kicking up a little bit. Yeah, I'm a hot mess. I love it. Hands are dirty. It's been a great day. And yeah, we have beans on the way. We do put in two or three crops of beans every year. And um, usually the first crop 
is eaten up fresh, yeah. And uh, the other lager crops are the ones that we usually do the canning on, but yeah, really glad to have those in the ground. Mark can start asking if beans are up yet. And um, yeah, absolutely beautiful morning and I love it. I am really glad that you chose to spend a few minutes of your day with me. I hope you have a wonderful day. If you're not subscribed to the channel, please subscribe. Don't forget to ring that little bell. I'm going to let you know when I'm out here excited about something else green in the garden. And um, if you have any comments, questions, suggestions, anything at all in your mind, please leave them in the little box below. And if you enjoyed today's video as much as I enjoyed making it, please give it a thumbs up. But yeah, I've got a few other things I need to get to and really, really happy to have the beans in. Oh. Yeah, the first crop. So, anyway, I'm going to go ahead and get on out of here. Don't forget, we love you, and we'll see you in the next one.